even get to Ross. Hello YouTube and welcome back to Wesley R Tech. Today I'm going to have an odd video similar to my last video, only different. Now, I had this problem for a while in Minecraft, and it was really hard to solve, and I just couldn't solve it. It was this. So when I launch my Minecraft, and I play, there's no problem. Now, this is only on Minecraft Forge, on Minecraft Forge 1.7.10 as far as I know. Actually, I think it's 1.7.2 as well. But the problem was, every time I created a new world or uh, and tried to play a world, any time I tried to play an old world or create a new world on Minecraft Forge 1.7.10, this is what I would get. So, say I play this world, it would say loading world, building terrain, just like normal. But then it would say shutting down internal server. And this would go infinitely as far as I know. Maybe you would get a crash eventually. In fact, I would have to force quit Minecraft in order to do this. Now, it's really annoying because I couldn't play Forge at all. Like, Forge was completely unable to work. Now, the epo the, there's a really, really simple solution for this. In fact, it surprised me when I found it out. Um, this, this solution works not only on Mac, but on PC as well. So it's a PC and Mac solution, as far as I know. What you want to do is you want to locate your Mi Minecraft folder. If you're new to Wesley R Tech, um, if you're old to Wesley R Tech, you should know how to do that. But if you're new, you won't. Uh, so I'm just going to go over. You click Go. This is for Mac. You do this Apida thing and look it up on PC. It's pretty easy to find. But you go to Go on Mac. You press Option on your keyboard. Then you have library. Go to library. Go to application support. You go to mail. Minecraft. Then you drag your Minecraft folder into here for future use. Once you have Minecraft in there. So now you have basically the programming or support for Minecraft. Um, now the problem. There's only a simple problem here. That single file. That single file is causing your entire Minecraft to crash, and you can't play any of your awesome mods just because of options.txt. You can't play Lucky Blocks. You can't play Galacticraft. You can't do anything just because of options.txt. So, what you do is you take options.txt and you get rid of it. You destroy it. Terminate. Exterminate. 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 Yeah. So, you just get rid of it. You get rid of it. Drag it anywhere. Get rid of it. Get it out of your Minecraft folder. Then, when you go to Minecraft, And you play. Now, for the moment of truth. Let's play this world. Dun dun, and it works perfectly. Oh, 
Oh, mods will now work. Woohoo! Perfect. Perfect. Although I think I'm on Adventure Man. I don't know. I'm not able. Huh. I'm not able to place block. But that's not because of that. Something else. I don't know. It's probably controls or something. Um. Wait, uh. Um. Yeah, see, um. Yeah, my controls were reset. That's the only thing that happened. That I know of. Um, attack, destroy, no, that should be H, um, that should be G, that's how I like it. And now, for the moment of truth, cobblestone, destroy, I can now play my mods. Yes, yes, yes. Woohoo! I hope you enjoy. Well, not, I hope you, I don't hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoy your mods that you can now play. Goodbye, and subscribe for more helpful